Department of Veterans Affairs announced today that it's partnering with the University of Iowa and Iowa City VA healthcare system to help student veterans succeed in school. The program known as iCove is the first ever initiative in the country to help the transition from deployment to a classroom. CBS 2 News reporter Marissa Scott joins us now with one student's story and how he thinks this pilot program will be beneficial. Marissa. That's right, Scott and Tiffany. The University of Iowa serves about 600 student veterans. Now 90 of those veterans will be graduating this month. This program will help veterans enter college and provide classes geared for students to take their military training and put what they learned into a classroom. Michael Considine is like any other college student. He wants to succeed in the classroom and out of the classroom. This program, for me, it'll be beneficial. A program that he says could help not only him readjust after deployment. He has been deployed twice. He says going back to school wasn't easy. Extremely difficult. Switching from school to a technical mindset and a deployment and then coming directly right back to school again was totally a transition. A big transition that many other veterans have gone through and they want to help future students conquer. Students being able to come back after they uh, register or enroll and already get the ball rolling trying to figure out what they're going to do. Student vets at UI will be able to enroll in a pilot program next spring. Transition from the military into post-secondary education and we'll do this via revision of an existing course we've developed and the writing of a text. Textbook. Dr. Hall designed this program to help veterans get jobs, deal with post-deployment trauma, obtain their diploma, as well as support them and their families. With it being the only program of its kind in the country, it's a way for vets to also feel at home. Veterans are very different, and especially here on campus. Although we may understand each other and really understand each other's experiences, no one veteran is the same as another. Student vets like Considine say they don't only want to be remembered as a vet, but also a college graduate. Considine is scheduled to graduate next May. Now at least 15 universities have looked into the program to use on their campus. This program is designed for two-year and four-year universities. Marissa Scott, CBS2 News.